guys welcome back to my channel this is what my hair usually looks like on an old wash and go it's pretty frizzy around the edges and more defined to the middle because I always have it in a pineapple but this is what it usually looks like before I go into my hairstyles I like to wet my hair around where the frizzy parts are which is basically my entire head um, and then I smoothen it down I also do this in the middle of my hair as well too and I don't really wet it down to the point of which it's dripping I just use it until it's damp so the products can be seeped into my head and products product because I'm using one product which is the Lata Body Cream I use that in the ends just to help with the definition and to bring back some, some life into my ends Like you have seen in my previous videos before, I am using the Lotta Body in the ends where most of my hair is usually frizzy and sometimes are the, are the roots as well too. Um, you don't have to use this cream, you can use a leave-in conditioner or whatever product you decide to use. You can use gel as well too, but I prefer the cream. First hairstyle I'm doing is a half up half down hairstyle. I take the front portion of my hair, which is not a lot, but this is where, like I said before, it's mostly frizzy. And I just roll that back up into a kind of hair tie in the back. I use a hairpin to pin it down until I'm done because I only have two hairpins and I'm pretty sure most of you girls can relate to the struggle. We start off with hundreds and end up with five but in my case I have two so I'm just gonna hold that up in place until I'm done with the other side I'm gonna do the exact same thing you can use well pull up or hold up as much here as you wish you can do more I just like the front bits just so I can get take away from the fuzziness and put that up in a hair tie I just smoothen the top of my hair and add some hairpins. Use black because you don't want the colors to show. Those frizzy bits you see in there, you can just add product to it or water, whichever you're liking. Um, this is the first hairstyle. It's very easy. It doesn't take time. And I like it because I'm lazy and I just want to get out of the house and look presentable. So this hairstyle is usually for the days when my hair is super undefined and frizzy and I do not want my hair to be open. So it's gonna put my hair in two and then roll it and then put it in a bun. If your hair is really defined still then you can leave it out but me on the other hand I like to roll it up. It can look presentable as well. You can use hairpins to pin down the hair as well. You can also do it as tight as you want or as loose as you want. It all depends on preference and how you like to have your hair. Also use a comb to part because I kind of like to use my fingers because I'm lazy. So use a comb. Alright, and this is the final hairstyle. You can add hairpins whichever you like and make it tighter, but I prefer it like this. Loose, you can also fix the edges. 
all the way to you like in this hairstyle is not your average messy bun hairstyle it's a messy bun with some style I should say um, I'm just using some curls to the front of my hair you can do one you can do as much as you wish um, it's a messy bun so it doesn't have to be as neat but my messy bun usually have certain days that it usually looks good and certain days it doesn't look good so it all depends and also my hair is so long and short so sometimes not all the hair goes into the bun so you know it's a it's a messy look and the curls in front is gonna help it look a little more presentable This is the end result of the messy bun with curls. It's kind of a 90s prom vibes, if you get what I'm saying. Um, I just add some curls to the back just to give the back of my hair a little bit of niceness, the distraction from the bun because it doesn't come out well all the time. Um, before you split the curls into more than one pieces, make sure it is completely dry because if it's wet, it's going to end up frizzy and it's going to lose definition. And the curl pattern is what you want so make sure it is dry before splitting it into more pieces and this is the end result of hairstyle number oh my god what hairstyle number is this it's gonna be on the screen i really can't remember what hairstyle is i think this is tree though last but not least uh another messy bun but it's a messy bun where you can basically be versatile with it you can put it down you can put it um to the side you can put it high up depends on whatever you are feeling that day you can do um i'm just gonna do a flat twist in front two to be exact and you'll see those and then you'll see the rest All right, and now on to the messy bun. Like I said, it's a messy bun, so it doesn't have to be neat. But my messy buns decide when they want to be good. And also, my hair is long and short. Short in the back, long all over the place. So, 
it doesn't really be good all the time but like i said it's a messy bun so you can get away with it um before you lose these these twists guys make sure it is dry i emphasize that make sure it is dry you want definition make sure it is dry I'm so tired and fed up of this bun, but I'm trying to get it to look okay. But the twists in front, I'm just about to lose those out. If you want these to be really, really defined, I would suggest you do it the day before you're about to go out or a few hours. If you want the definition, do it before because you saw I added product and added water to it. So it's not going to be really, really defined. Again, if you want it to be defined, do it the day before or hours. So you see, I don't have a lot of definition, but there's still something there. So now you see the whole idea of the hairstyle. I just pull that back to the back. I use a hairpin and I pin it back. It all depends on if you want it flowy or tight or big. It all depends on what you work with in that day. You can put it how low you want. Use hairpins. Hairpin saves lives. Um, I just try to fix it. it Manipulate it however you feel. To your liking. Alright guys. This is the final look. Comment down below which hairstyle is your favorite. And which you would try. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, y'all.